Hey guys, Amelia here. So today is a very exciting day for me because I'm doing a Sephora haul. So let's start with the boring stuff first. I stocked up on my shampoo and conditioner. I've been trying this stuff since the beginning of this year and I really really like how this stuff makes my hair look. It really does make my hair look like it has a perfect hair day. So yeah, the be living up to its name. What I noticed is I haven't been really touching up my makeup on the go because I don't have a brush with me. I decided to get one so that I can touch up more often. Next thing I got is actually for my pores. This is the Operation for Proof. This thing comes with a bunch of benefit samples. Out of these five, I'm kinda obsessed with the shiny. I finally got the Naked Palette. I've been holding back on getting this because it is kind of steep. It's $83. Next I'm definitely going to play around with this even more. I hope I'm not jinxing this, but I think this can be my next best favorite palette. So far, I really like how it applies. I really like how it looks. I love the color. But we shall see. We shall see whether it lasts all day long. I usually don't finish mascara, so I'm really excited to get this small one, especially because it has the lash primer as well inside. I've never used lash primer before. I think it's about time because usually mascaras, they just smudge on me. It gets a very cooling feeling once you put it on your skin, which is really nice, especially in this kind of weather. And uh, it was super pigmented when I swatched it on. When I tried it at home, it wasn't as pigmented as it was in store. I don't know why. We shall see. I'm gonna try this out again because okay, I really, I really like the color and the cooling feeling to it. So I'm really hoping that this can work. The next thing I got is the Nars Audacious lipstick in the color Anita. Thank you so much, Tiara, for recommending this. I really like the formula. I really like the color. I can't wait to try more colors from this collection. I finally decided to invest in a lip pencil. buying a lip pencil but I don't really have any benchmark to like compare but I really like the color and the consistency of this I definitely like them both I really like how they smell the formula is very moisturizing and uh, I'm probably gonna wear coral more if I want more color but if I want something more natural something more like my lips color then I will go with those so I really like them both I've heard so many people rave about this and I've been trying to try it out. It's very refreshing and it smells really nice. It smells very cooling as well. That's nice. I saw Estee wearing this and she was raving about this. So because of that, I actually got this. I just realized that apparently with my whole purchase, I can actually make
like this video. And yeah, that's all that I have.